All right. So what's up, everybody? Your boy John Deere Man Twenty Two here. Welcome back to another video. So today is January eighteenth, twenty twenty four, and as always, welcome back to the channel. Been on YouTube for seven years now, and yeah. So anyway, um, so there's no FS news today. There won't be any. I don't think there'll be any tomorrow. Um. Episodes 27 and 28 of Lego Mario and Ninjago are happening today. And then tomorrow, Lego Mario and Ninjago Season 3, Episodes 29, and the final episode, Episode 30, will be happening on Friday. So that will be nice to get that season done. So, yeah, but anyway... Um, so this Sunday, I'm going to be doing some FS22 season nine episodes as I didn't get around to doing that on December 24th, 2023. <sighs> yeah, I don't understand it, you guys, but that's just the way things go. So anyway... So let's talk about FS22 Season 9. So I got everything set on what is going to bring what home. Um, the Alice Chalmers 7080 and the John Deere 4955 are going to both bring the wagons home. The Grand Truck is going to bring the header trailer home with the bean head on it. The, um, let's see here, the um, 7488's got the disc, the 8410's got the planter, the 4320's got the, the main auger, which I might have to sell the main, au main auger that I'm going to use and get the one that I was originally starting off with. Well, that came with the map when I started it with all the starting equipment, which that auger is 10 times bigger than, than anything. So, yeah. So, there's just, yeah, there's not a lot I can say about it right now. So, yeah. But the 1066... When it's not pulling a set of wagons during the fall, when I'm combining like beans or oats or whatever, that doesn't really require mad rushing and doesn't yield or it's not that high in yielding and stuff like soybeans and oats. So yeah, those are just yeah so when it's not doing that it's gonna be doing uh, a different job which is well it's got two uh it's got one other job besides pulling the wagons when it's soybean harvest and during soybean harvest and running the flatbed trailer up to the shop to get fertil to get seed and liquid fertilizer which is corn stalk chopping now i know it's open station tractor but it doesn't bother me a bit it'll be fine and if i don't like the 1066 on there then the 4320 will go on the stock chopper but the 1066 will do just fine as long as I don't mow over any grass or anything. <laughs> Put some grass in the field. But, nah. So, yeah. Once I get, like, into the middle of the field and everything, I'll probably, probably do, like, two headlands on one end, then go up and around, do two, and go along the edge and do a 
two more headlamps and then over there and then come back around on the, along the edge and then see if I can hire a worker. But some of them fields aren't straight, so more or less that means that uh, I'll be doing the same thing I was doing back in Season 8, doing everything myself. Combining, planting, yeah, cultivating or disking. Yeah. And hauling grain and running grain cart. <laughs> yeah, so... Anyway. So... There's not a lot that I can say about, well, about anything right now, but yeah. So the last thing that's going to be coming home will be the combine, which I actually screwed up on the pipe configuration. So I got to go, so I got to bring that up to the... So I got to bring that to the spot where I can either sell it or customize it. I got to hit customize because if one wrong move and if I hit net sell, then I'm without a combine and then I'm really up a crick. So that wouldn't be good. Yeah. So <laughs> anyway, so yeah, everything's going to be going just fine when I start season nine and everything else like that. Um, now, as far as I know, um, yes, the yard is big. I mean, it's a big yard, but everything will be fine and we'll find spots for all the machinery and everything. Well, I'll find spots for all the machinery and everything, combine, uh, and all that stuff. So, uh, yeah, we'll see just how well things go. So, yeah. But, yeah, so the grain truck that is painted in, I gave it a, I give it, I gave it a special livery of light blue and um and white because that's what my grandpa's old grain truck was was light blue even though it was probably a different shade of blue back in when it was new but since then it was faded and yeah, so light blue and and white box so yeah so that'll make harvest go a little bit faster load up what one grain truck and four wagons holding that be i'll be running like mad getting trying to get everything done <laughs> yeah i shouldn't i should probably yeah, buy like two other trailers because then the cause then like the 1066 and um and the 1066 and the well either the 1206 or the 5020 whichever one comes out first will come out and we'll run those and we'll run those two wagons during soybean harvest but Nah, I don't know. It might be kind of a close to an upgrade if I would keep nah, the two 400s and, and hook them up to the back of those trailers. That would be kind of cool. So, anyway. But, with that being said, I will see you guys all tomorrow. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the notification bell for each and every upload, and I'll see you guys all tomorrow. Later, you guys. Stay safe out there, everybody.